Good evening crafters, it's me Ella, welcome back to my channel and today we are going to do a third third Christmas card with the same pattern paper. I decided that I'm going to do all of the Christmas cards with the same pattern papers because um, sometimes we just don't have the time or we just don't want to do too much. So I'm going to show you how to use two pattern papers, packs, and then create some nice cards if I can. Obviously, we'll see how it goes. So today I'm going to be using Love to Craft Jolly Christmas. I believe that's an old pack, but I think you can still find it online. And you can still buy it. So I'm going to be using this Merry Holidays, which is over here. And uh, this was already scrap. So I used a piece of this card somewhere else. So I only used the, the one that is left over. <clears throat> over here we have the beautiful, uh, beautiful um snowman so i'm going to be using only a piece of it and this is the christmas trees that i still have left over so this one is four and a quarter this is just a quarter no this is just um half half an inch this is half an inch and this is just a quarter so this is quite small and this snowman is from my stash a little small so first i'm going to assemble a panel that i decided to do for my little snowman so i've got double-sided tape and i need to put my double-sided tape all the way over here let me just do it yeah So I'm going to put this one here and I'm going to assemble this lovely panel. These are two, this red is different than this one because it's just a scrap. So it's a very good way of using your scraps. There you go. There's one and there's another one. Mm -hmm. Whoops, whoops. Where are you going? And now all you gotta do is just make like little flaps, little wings. One and a two. Okay, so now I'm going to glue my snowman on top of it, which is quite easy. Perfecto. Now put this one aside and I'm going to let it dry as well. And I'm going to pop it with some dimensions. So these are my dimensions that I like. Oh, this one I don't. This one I do. These are really nice. And I like them. They're very cool. I need them as a pattern. Really, really cool. I don't really mind to pop them how much I want because they are very nice and soft. There you go. That's done. Now this is going to be lying on the side and I'm going to assemble this card. So I'm going to put some glue over here. And I'm going to assemble this panel right to the bottom. And now just a tiny bit of glue. And I am not going to stick it so much because I need to <clears throat> I need to make sure that everything is in place. And now this one is going to go all the way over here. So very slowly, I'm going to move my paper. You can still move it. Oh, it's good things about the glue that you can still move it. Okay, and this panel will go all the way over here. This panel will be here, perfect. So this is my panel and now I'm going to 
put it all down I'm going to take backing paper from my snowman let me just put it over here guys so it's closer my little bin yeah there's another piece of paper here you go I could use the pokey too but I like taking the paper off here you go last one and now this is going to go all the way over here to make my Christmas ready perfect this snowman is already have the glitter but I'm going to add just a little bit of gl glitter for one happy holidays and I'm going to follow the letters hopefully it's going to come out oops okay now it's coming out so we're going to just follow the Mary letters so they are standing out Kidoki. and this is the finished card for today so i hope you enjoy it so it's very easy card this is how it looks like from this is the close-up of the card it's very easy really nice it's got one two three different pattern papers these are my scraps i hope you enjoy it stay tuned for the next videos thanks for watching guys bye